everyone, Andy here with the uh, brand new Panasonic Lumix GH1 still camera. This is a uh, kind of a strange thing for us here at Able to have a still camera, so you're probably wondering why I'm showing this to you today. Well, this actually has some very cool things that actually apply well to our market. So first off, uh, this is the successor to the G1, the Panasonic Lumix G1, which is the first micro four-third camera that they produced. It's an all-digital camera, has an LCD flip-out and an electronic viewfinder. It's a very cool 12 megapixel camera, the GH1 is. Uh, great stills, but it can also shoot uh, 1080p 24p video and 720 60p video, uh, which was quite a surprise for us to see in a still camera. So we thought, how can we use this in our in our market, and how good is it? So we did some tests, and actually really impressed with the, what the camera produces. And more importantly, it has a very large sensor. This is a four third sensor, uh, very large. You can see here uh, in the video. There it is, very nice. And it actually, is a very very uh, shallow flange depth, which allows you to put all kinds of different lenses directly on here. That's one of the advantages of the Micro Four Thirds system, is you can put all kinds of adapters to make it work with different things. And of course, here we are in the cinema world, so we want to put on a PL mount adapter. Right? That's right. This is the, uh, the first PL mount adapter to Micro Four Third uh, that goes directly onto the camera. Um, it's a very easy to put on. Snap it in there. I have the system. This is from a company called Hot Rod. They make this adapter, and they also make a very cool support system to go with it. Now, this support, this, this piece here is the support, and it comes with rod tie downs as well. It's designed to support the camera, and more importantly, support that PL adapter, so you're not putting any weight directly onto the camera. It's also designed specifically for this camera, the very narrow piece here, so the batteries can be taken out while you're using uh, this system. Um, also, with the system, the, this is the deluxe kit, it comes with this handle, this handle grips that actually make it very easy to work with the camera and the lens at the same time. So, you know, I think it's a little overkill to put a PL mount on there. Well, you got to see it first. So I'm going to put the lens on there uh, and come right back. All right, so there you go. Tie that back down. It actually has two lockdown spots, one for the camera, one for the PL mount lens, like I said before. And you can see here, I also have the ability to adjust the height of the rod, so I can place a map box, follow focus, and set, et cetera, onto this. Uh, the handhold set setup is very nice, designed so I can uh, very easily hold the camera up and reach back to my record button, which is back here on the camera as well, the little red button there. Uh, and I can I can hand hold the setup and adjust my lens. Now you're wondering, what are you going to put on there? You know, all those PL mount lenses are one really expensive and also uh, very very uh, big. Well, I want to show you the uh, brand new compact primes from Zeiss. These are uh, Ze new Zeiss lenses, very high quality, very nice lenses, uh, housed. To for PL and adjusted for PL. And these are great. This is a great setup. This is a 15 millimeter lens. It's actually quite light, even though it's big. It's really light. Very easy to use. I'm going to put this directly onto my setup here. Very easy to do. Lock it down, and there you go. A Zeiss Compact Prime on a GH1. What a cool setup. I really like this. This is one of the most exciting products this year. I guarantee it. Uh, I want you guys to come in, check this out. Uh, thanks for watching the video, and we'll see you next time.